The July foreclosure numbers in our area are very good for the four-county area, Dallas, Tarrant, Collin, and Denton counties. The filings are down, and the decline in foreclosures appears likely to keep going. Mark Blooms at Net Worth Realty USA, and Mark, the drop in foreclosures is good news for neighborhoods, isn't it? Yeah, I think it should help them. I mean, the, the chances of it really hurting them is more of a, a future risk in that, hey, if someone's holding a 1,000 properties, and let's just say, or a couple of companies are holding a 1,000 properties, and let's just say Plano, uh, that's great. They bought them up. They're off the market. They're no longer foreclosures. They're no longer the lower end of the market in that neighborhood, and so they're not bringing the market down. But that institutional owner is strictly there for profit means, and if the opportunity comes for them to sell those properties in a bulk or individually on the open market, they will, I don't know if they'll flood the market, but you put a thousand properties on the market, it's going to have an effect. Is there better news to come, or have we hit the bottom of this? You've definitely hit the bottom of the downturn of the market. As a matter of fact, we're past the downturn. We're on the upturn of that trough. In other words, we're starting to climb back up. As far as this being the best news possible or what's on the horizon, I mean, listen, it's always good when we find our bottom and the market starts to climb. I think it makes sense for people. I think our foreclosures are down. If you look at the correlation between two numbers, so you're saying filings in North Texas are down 43%. If you look at the numbers, and you can look at them nationally, most, and we didn't have a huge downturn, but most markets are about 50% back from where they were at their peaks. So you can see the correlation between the foreclosures and the values. What's the, in your opinion, what's the general sense of the, of the home building, home selling situation in North Texas? Well, I mean, it's hot. In, at Networth Realty, we deal strictly with investment properties. And we've always sold a lot of property, but the last, I'll say, six to eight months, we have sold a significant amount of property, and that property has been selling at a higher price because there's less inventory, more demand. Every market is strictly supply demand. So the market is strong. Home builders are coming back, uh, and they're coming back in large part two reasons. One, the market is back. Two, financing is back. And real estate in America, it's two-pronged. You need not just the demand and the desire to buy a house, but you need the ability to finance that through a bank, and they are providing that presently. And so our market is roaring back, and anyone who's sitting on the sidelines waiting, my personal, professional opinion, is that they're wasting time and dollars. Right now, if you have an interest in buying a property, you should be buying a property.